hello everyone welcome to my channel ria study circle it is a requested video from my viewers so let's start the video today i am going to explain about eighth class maths chapter number 10 direct and inverse proportion in that exercise 10.1 tenth problem so the tenth problem is the design of a microchip has the scale 40 to 1 the length of the design is 18 centimeters find the actual length of the microchip so here we have two microchips one with the actual length 1 cm scale is 40 cm another with the actual length we have to find that scale is 18 cm so firstly we have to understand what is scale if you see this map here we have four, four places Tirupati, Vijayawada, Vishakapatnam, Varangal here the given scale 1 cm equal to 300 km so if you measure the distance between Tirupati to Vijayawada if it is 5 cm that means 1 cm equal to 300 so 5 cm equal to we already know 5 into 300 so it is equal to 1500 kilometers so here the distance between Tirupati to Vijayawada is how much 1500 kilometers same like if you measure the distance between Vijayawada to Vishakapatnam is 3 cm that means 3 into 300 kilometers it is nothing but 900 kilometers so we can't measure that much of kilometers in a paper so that's why we will take the scale like this similarly here see the microchip in the hand it is around 1 cm it is very small to show this bigger we have to do the design with 40 cm scale so here we have two microchips one with the 40 cm scale 1 cm actual length and another microchip design scale is 18 centimeters we have to find the actual length let's see the solution first we have to write what is given in the problem so given is the design of a microchip has the scale 40 is to 1 That means actual length of microchip is 1 cm. On design, the scale of microchip is 40 cm. In direct and inverse proportion we have the variables x and y so here we have to take this actual length of microchip 1 cm as x1 and in design the scale of microchip 40 cm as y1 and the second information is the length of the design is 18 cm so here actual length of the microchip we have to find that is nothing but x2 and on design they given the length of the microchip is that means nothing but scale of the microchip is 18 centimeters that is the y2 so if you see we have to take actual length of the both microchips as x and on design the scales of both microchip as y so that's why I am taking here actual length of microchip 1 cm as x1 and the second microchip actual length we have to find that is x2 and in design the scale of microchip is 40 cm as y1 the scale of microchip is 18 cm is y2 if you see scales of the microchip is decreases from 40 cm to 18 cm so of course the actual length of microchip also will decrease from 1 cm to whatever it is so if you see both x and y are in which proportion direct proportion that is we have to represent x is directly proportional to y so what is the formula for direct proportion we already know the formula is x1 by y1 equal to x2 by y2 this is the formula for direct proportion so if you see we have all the terms values 
that is x1 y1 x2 y2 simply substitute all three values in this formula then we will get the value of x2 so let's substitute x1 is 1 by y1 is 40 equal to x2 is x2 we have to find y2 is 18 so simply we have to do the cross multiplication x2 equal to 1 into 18 by 40 so we have to cancel in two table 2 9s are 18 2 20s are 40 so we have x2 equal to 9 by 20 centimeters in your textbook this only the answer if you want to do further calculation you can do 9 by 20 you can cancel this in two table 2 10s are 2 4s are 8.5 so 2 into 4.5 is 9 by 2 10s are 20 4.5 by 10 so in denominator if you have 10 one digit will be move front side so that means x2 equal to what 0 0.45 centimeters so the final statement we have to write what is x2 actual length of the microchip whose design is 18 centimeters so therefore actual length of microchip x2 is equal to 9 by 20 centimeters or you can also write 0 0.45 centimeters so this is the actual length of microchip whose scale is 18 centimeters in the design so this is our today's video i hope this video is helpful for you if you have any doubts or if you want any problem with solution then please comment below i will definitely try to explain in my next video if you want these videos in Telugu, then comment below. I will definitely explain in Telugu also. If you want videos in Telugu, please comment and in Telugu. If you are confused to get my videos, then please go to playlist in my channel. I will upload all my videos playlist wise so you can easily find them. Thank you for watching. Please support me by like, share and subscribe my channel. And click the bell icon to get my latest updated videos when I post.